Welcome back. Spring is here, and most importantly, spring break, and what a better time than now to enjoy a cookout with family and friends. But let's face it, not all of us are pro barbecuers, and we could use a few tips to make sure we impress our guests. So we welcome to our studio Marcus Williams and Sequela Williams from Louisiana Smokehouse to help us out. Guys, thank you so much for being with us today. Thanks thank for you. having us. So I know we have some do's and don'ts. We have yes. a fire extinguisher right here that's very important. We're going to get to that in just a second. Yes. Marcus, tell me about some of the do's, the things that you might want to make sure you do when you are going to throw a barbecue. When you're throwing a barbecue, you want to make sure everything you're using is extra, extra clean. You want to get rid of all grease and debris from your grill. Um, you just want to make sure you're using clean utensils, clean equipment, you know what I'm saying? Because that keeps down you know starting a fire yes so do you want to clean your grill before you use it like exactly. if it's dirty from the last time you want to make sure you clean it you want to make sure you want to make sure it, it, it helps keep down the fire hazard and also it's good for you to eat yes and also speaking about cleanliness i see some gloves over there do you want to make sure that you use some gloves whenever you're cooking you for have your to friends? you just have to you know what i'm saying it's so many diseases and so many allergies out there so you just want to make sure you're protecting everyone and safe you know eating clean eating safe you just want to do that. Yes, and speaking of safety, also we want to talk about this fire extinguisher. Is it important to keep something like this around when you're throwing a barbecue for your friends? Especially <laughs> a barbecue. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Especially, but you want to make sure you keep a fire extinguisher. Make sure you read the directions on the fire extinguisher. Um, sometimes, depending on the fire extinguisher you buy, you might want to stop by the fire department and have them check it out. Make sure it's safety. Make sure the pin is inserted the right way. and. You're good to go. Once the fire department approves it, then you're good to go. Okay, and where can you get something like this? Um, I have no idea where I would even buy a fire You can go to Home Depot, okay. you can go to Sam's, Lowe's, any, any type of place like that. You know what I'm saying? Or you can just Google. Just use your Google. Yeah. <laughs> Google helps out. Sequela, can you tell me about some of the things that we want to make sure we don't do when throwing a barbecue? <laughs> we, um, you just want to make sure that you keep, um, that you don't have, um, the grill, like how he said, you mm -hmm. want to clean it because the more um, grease and the more fat that you have on there, it makes it more fuel for the fire. Yes. And you also want to um, keep your grill like 10 feet away from okay. the exactly. house, the car, the carport, anything, anything that can catch on fire easily, you want to keep it away from. So just make sure that you keep the um, grill at least 10 feet away and also keep um just keep some water nearby, like in a spray bottle or something, just in case the flames go up, you can quickly kind of spray it out okay. just a little bit. So. Yeah, that's important. Awesome. And then also, if you don't even want to, you don't even know what you're doing. I have no <laughs> idea what to do when it comes to barbecuing. So you guys can help me out with that. I can come buy all of my meat for all of my friends. Tell me about that. Awesome. If you don't have anything to do, you don't want to just deal with any barbecue, period, that's what we are here for. You can give us a call. You can stop by our food trailer. We'll be happy to help you. We can serve anywhere from one to 1,000 people. All you have to do is give us a call, stop by. My wife will be happy to help you out. Also, I will, too. I mean, this is what we're here for. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Louisiana Smokehouse. Yeah, you guys are ready to help us out. Well, this looks really, really good in front of us. Thank you guys so much for the tips. We definitely want to keep that in mind so you are safe this spring break if you're throwing a barbecue with your friends. Thank you again, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Stay with us. We're telling you how to stay fit and healthy even during spring break vacation. Stay with us. <laughs> 